Chemistry is a fascinating field. It explores the building blocks of our universe. But with great knowledge comes great responsibility. Some chemical compounds, while remarkable for their properties, pose significant threats to human health and safety. These chemicals, often products of ambitious research or accidental discoveries, remind us of the potential dangers lurking in the laboratory. Their stories, marked by cautionary tales and stringent safety protocols, underscore the importance of responsible handling and a deep respect for the power of chemistry. These dangerous chemicals are not figments of science fiction. They are very real, and understanding their properties is crucial for anyone working with or studying them. One such chemical is chlorine trifluoride, a substance so reactive it was investigated by Nazi Germany as a potential weapon during World War II. Imagine a chemical so volatile that it boils on contact with air and explodes violently when it touches water. That's chlorine trifluoride. The Nazis, known for their ruthless pursuit of advanced weaponry, were intrigued by its potential to melt bunkers and incinerate anything in its path. Despite its terrifying power, chlorine trifluoride proved too dangerous even for wartime use. Production goals were set at 90 tonnes per month, but only 30 tonnes were ever produced due to its extreme instability. Today, chlorine trifluoride is primarily used in the semiconductor industry for cleaning equipment. However, its handling requires extreme caution, and it is stored in airtight drums to prevent any accidental releases. If chlorine trifluoride is the volatile rebel of the chemical world, then azoazide azide is the ultimate drama queen. This compound holds the dubious distinction of being the most explosive chemical ever synthesized. Imagine a substance so sensitive that even the slightest disturbance, a gentle touch, a stray ray of light, or even the vibrations from an X-ray could trigger a detonation. That's azoazide azide. The extreme instability of azoazide azide arises from the arrangement of its nitrogen atoms. They are loosely bound in a high-energy state, like a group of tightly wound springs ready to snap at the slightest provocation. This makes studying azoazide azide incredibly challenging and dangerous. In fact, its sensitivity is so high that it's difficult to even measure accurately. Section 4. Dimethylcadmium and Thioacetone Toxicity and Terror not all dangerous chemicals explode on contact. Some exert their harm more subtly through insidious toxicity. Dimethylcadmium, CH32CD, is one such example. This organocadmium compound is highly toxic, causing severe damage to the lungs, kidneys, and liver upon inhalation. But that's not all. Dimethylcadmium also reacts violently with water, producing flammable hydrogen gas and posing an explosion risk. Then there's theoacetone, a chemical that takes the concept of a bad smell to a whole new level. In 1889, a small spill of theoacetone in Freiburg, Germany, caused widespread nausea and vomiting, forcing the evacuation of the entire city. The stench was so powerful that it could be detected miles away. Even today, theoacetone is considered one of the smelliest substances known to man, a testament to the power of chemistry to assault our senses. Section 5. Fluoroantimonic Acid, the Ultimate Solvent Finally, we arrive at fluoroantimonic acid, HSBF6, a superacid so potent that it makes sulfuric acid look like water. Imagine a substance so corrosive that it can eat through glass, Teflon and even human bones. Fluoroantimonic acid is 10 quadrillion times stronger than sulfuric acid, capable of protonating even the most unreactive substances. Handling fluoroantimonic acid requires extraordinary precautions. It reacts violently with water, releasing dangerous fumes. Even its storage poses a challenge, as it readily dissolves most materials. Fluoroantimonic acid is a stark reminder that the most innocuous-looking substances can possess incredible power, and a healthy respect for the unknown is paramount in the world of chemistry. If you found this video informative, please like, comment, and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the world of chemistry.